Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Sunday Morning Simulcast with Rom Wills. Find the joy in your life. Find the joy. I'm going to tell you what. We need joy. Everybody needs joy in their lives. Everyone, every single person. Because, yeah, we got a lot of bad stuff going on. Let me be clear. As positive as I am, I recognize some bad things are happening and everything. Hey, I'm going to use myself as, as an example because I'm a shoot. I had that stroke. Now, that's a bad thing. But even then, I found the reason why I was able to come back from it and still coming back from it, but come back quicker than a lot of people. Because remember, I couldn't, I couldn't eat. I couldn't walk. But I came back because of joy. I came back because of finding the joy. I was like, well, I'm still alive. Joy. All right, yeah, I can't, I can't walk, I can't eat, but I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a find a way to address both of them. You know, walking at first, every, every, like when I was able to take a couple steps without using some prop or without using a walker or anything, I was like, okay, I found joy in it. When I was able to swallow some ice, swallow some ice. I was taking joy in it. Every single thing you take some joy in. Like every single thing, every movement that you have towards having the life, the happy life that you want, you got to find joy in. You got to find it because there's always going to be some negative stuff. You know, you watch the news. They, let's be real. They going to share negative stuff with you. You know, if you got some bills to pay or you have a medical emergency or something. Yeah, that can be bad, but then find the joy. It's like, okay, you're still alive. Yes, you can do something to change this condition. You could do something. If you not you don't like the job you work on, hey, you can still do what you can. You can still look for another job, or you can get the certification, or figure out what you're really trying to do that you will find joy in. You can do that. You got to find it. That's one thing. Because all of us want to live that life. Let's be real. We want to live a life of positive pleasure. Positive. We want to hey, We want to be happy. It's there. It's there. Yeah, I know we all have our demons that we're fighting. We all going through something. I don't care who you are. But are you going to dwell on the negative stuff? Or are you going to find the positive stuff? Even if it's everything. Even little stuff. I'm thankful for waking up every day, even, even before the stroke. I was very thankful just to wake up, you know? Very thankful when I had trouble come up, thankful for being able to pay for something or to do something, shoot. I was I always, always in trouble with my car, thankful for being able to take care of it right away. Always, 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 and you know, thankful, as you can see, thankful for eating, <laughs> you know? hey. Don't, hey, there's some people out there, there are people out there who have trouble even eating. Be thankful for it. Be thankful, you know? Be thankful. Shoot, you're just eating. I'm going to tell you the truth. When I couldn't eat, when I had to uh, only feed through that G-tube, hey, I was like, you know what? We took for granted just everything. I remember speaking with the speech therapist about that. You know, you take for granted that about eating until you can't eat. Not just even having food, but just physically can't eat. All of a sudden, you're just like, oh, wow, I was taking that for granted. I'm finding joy in that, as you can see. <laughs> hey, look, I'm going to tell you what. I'm going to tell you what, though. You know, it's every day. I don't care what you're going through. Even if you, you might be homeless, you know, you're still alive. Find joy. You might be able to do something because you can, you can rise out of that position. I've read stories, numerous stories of people who've risen out of homelessness. All of a sudden, they living in like little mansions or they got some business going or they just have a happy life. You just have to find it. You have to look for it. You know, be happy. Find the silver lining no matter what's going on. You know, and that, that's everybody. And, you know, I might have talked about this on one form or, the, or, or another and I'll probably talk about it again in the future, because one of the things uh, I dislike, I personally dislike, is when I see people just dwell on the negative stuff, you know? But for every negative, there's a positive. Yeah, you want to still acknowledge it because you still got to deal with the situation, but you don't need to dwell on it. When bad things have happened to me, 
I've, I've never dwelled on it. I just say, okay, how can I fix this? How can I fix this? What can I do to fix this right away? And I've been through some stuff. Other than the stroke, I've been through some stuff. I have no problem saying it. But now I'm in a happy place. But I had to work for it. I had to work for it. And I still, you know, even when you reach that place where you feel like, oh, yeah, everything going well. Okay, you still got to maintain it. You still have to maintain it. And you still, and, and even in those places, you find joy in being grateful and having gratitude. Gratitude, however you choose to worship God, have gratitude, Just say a prayer of thanks, however you choose to worship. You still find that joy, you know? Like, just look at your life, sit down. If you're going through some trouble, look at your life now. Look at what you got going on. And no, you might be able to say, and even, even when you're looking at some of the negative stuff, is it really negative or are you just not having gratitude for what you do have? I want you to think about that. I want you to think about it, really meditate on that. Think about everything. That you even watching on a device now. Think about it, you watching this video on some type of device. Have joy that you can even do that. Because contrary to popular belief, uh, smartphones or laptops or stuff like that still has not reached uh, a saturation point. And a saturation point means every single person have it. It might think people do, but I mean, if you check any statistics, most people, well, I ain't going to say most, but there's still a few people who might not even have that. There's still some people out there who might not even have that, you know? So it's like, be thankful that you can even watch this. You can even watch this video, you know, that you hear my words and everything. And I'm not saying I'm all that. I'm just saying it might have been just what you needed to hear. It just might be what you needed to hear. I've had people hit me up and say, you know what? I needed to hear this. I needed to hear this. I mean, shoot, I've said that. There's been plenty of times people have said stuff to, to me or maybe on a video or something I needed to hear. To this day, let me say that again, to this day, because I'm always looking for the joy. I'm always looking for the joy. I'm looking to solve any issues. I'm always looking for the happiness because it's a lot better than feeling negative about something, feeling bad about something. Your body even feels better. When you feel in joy, think about it. When you feel in joy, Shoot, you, you feeling, your body even feeling better. You feeling good. And you want to stick with that. You want to stick with that. You always want to look for the joy in your life. And every single day, even in little things. Even in little things. All right? You know? And I, I'll, I'll just say, like I said, if you woke up this morning, hey, have joy. Have gratitude. All right? You know, you can eat something. Trust me, have gratitude, have joy. You have a, a roof over your head, have joy. Some people don't have that. Some people don't have that, you know? And some people have to work for something. So you look for it. Look for that joy in your life every single day. Trust me, it'll change something. If you do that for a solid 21 days, just 21 days, you'll, you'll see that your life, is no matter what's going on, will feel better, all right? So anyway... That's all I have for today. I want you to really look for the joy in your life, all right? And keep rising to become the best person that you are meant to be, all right? Peace and blessings, everyone.